Good morning. Welcome to the day in the life. We start things off very early. It's 11.40, let's go make some coffee. This is the coffee corner. Don't pay attention to the Keurig, that's blasphemous. This is the Chemex, this is where we make our coffee. This is the gooseneck water spout thing. This is where we put our water in and it has a temperature sensing device. This is our scale, which we use to measure things. Yeah, yeah, we got it. And this is the grinder. This is our reusable filter that we use to put the coffee beans in. This is all our coffee. I have a lot. Probably more than I should have. Let's choose one for today. Let's choose this one. For one cup of coffee, you usually need about 20 grams of beans. Put the beans in the grinder. Oh no. Grind the beans. Put your water on the stove to boil. We usually want it to get to 200 and five degrees okay now our water is hot let's make prime the chemex so we just make it we make this whole thing warm swirl it around so that when the coffee starts making it, it's it's going into a warm vessel you discard this water Shoot. Now you pour the grinded coffee that we had into the warm chemex. So we have 23 grams of grinded coffee. So we do usually 16 to 15 milliliters of water. So we have our water. So let's start. Let's start that. So the first pour is the most important pour. I don't know, I just made that up. But when you pour it, like, take a look. Like, you can do it, like, you start from the center, and then you, like, kind of, like, go out slowly. And then you, you let it bloom. This is called letting it, letting it, letting it bloom. Like, you see the bubbles? Like, that's called blooming. So I forgot the zero of the scale when I when I had the original beans, but uh, 23 times 15, 23 times 15. The answer is 345. Okay, so 345. So we're just gonna add that to so like around like 360, 370 uh, milliliters of water. So when that gets to 370, I'll stop pouring water. Some people say that making drip coffee this way is very therapeutic because it takes a really long time and you have to like pour and like, I don't know, it's therapeutic I guess, but like, you can just use the Keurig and it's really convenient, it just depends what you want I guess. So therapeutic. I put too much water in, but we're letting it sink. Okay, nice. Now we're done. And that's a spider. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, we got him outside. We spared a life today. Run away, dude. Go freaking be outside. I don't know. Okay, now pour in your favorite cup and you can enjoy. Well, also don't forget to clean your Chemex and your grinder thing because I didn't video that, but you need to clean your stuff as well. Okay, that's the end of the video. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe. Um, tell me if you want more of these videos.
Okay, bye.